This is the TV News, the industry's only daily video report. Brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative needs, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution. Welcome to the TV TV for Thursday, July 22nd. And we begin with what could develop soon into the mother of all retransmission and carriage wars. Now for more, we present the following exclusive interview. With us now is Uber reporter for NewJerseyNewsroom.com, Evan Weiner, with news on what could be the granddaddy of all retransmission and carriage wars. Evan, who are the combatants in this looming titanic struggle? Well, one of them is very familiar in the New York area. It's the Disney Company, uh, WABC in New York, ESPN and ESPN2 and all the other Disney networks. And uh, you could replace Cablevision, which had this war with uh, ABC Disney back in February with Time Warner. Time Warner shot at uh, beating on Disney for spending too much money or asking them for too much money for ESPN and also wanting money for Channel 7 here in New York. Okay, um, but this, I believe this goes wider than New York. Let me just throw some stuff at you. Um, Time Warner's footprint is 14 million subs coast to coast. New York being, you know, the premier market. L.A. being their premier market. Texas, Southern Ohio, and the Carolinas. And so we're looking at, if this war wages, it's going to be in the two biggest media markets, entertainment markets in the country. That's true, and uh, some of the uh, commercials that are being aired by the anti-Time Warner people, and could be Disney for all we know, are pretty hilarious. They're saying, hey, you do have a choice here. You could go to DirecTV, you could go to Verizon, you could even get Channel 7 over the air. And I guess Channel 7 could apply to Los Angeles as well, as that's KABC in Los Angeles. Um, there are websites now out there... Um, Time Warner has its uh, rollover or get tough, which basically wants to hold the line against cable price increases. And of course, Disney is saying, hey, don't listen to Time Warner, you know, disregard them. Just continue paying us. We'll give you the programming you want. You don't have to get it from uh, Time Warner. I'll tell you what, if, if, you know, KABC, WABC, and again, this is retransmission plus carriage, all the Disney networks go out, the Disney Kids networks, the, ES, the family of ESPN networks, this could be catastrophic. Do you agree with that? It could be catastrophic if you're a Time Warner subscriber, but, you know, if you take, you know, precautions right now and, and they're obviously telling you, hey, you got five weeks if you want to switch over, you don't have to be held hostage to Time Warner. I'll, here's what, what we'll do, Evan. We will watch this very, very closely over the next five weeks. I hope we can have you back here maybe if these guys haven't resolved it within two weeks, and then we'll just, we'll just keep watching it and we'll see what happens but I'm worried. I'm very, very worried. Sales, Marketing, and Trends is brought to you by Combridges, your internet and multi-screen marketing go-to guides. Visit us at Combridges.com. Everyone in the business knows that characters are welcome at USA, right? Sure. Well, now cable TV's number one network is taking their brand mantra to the next level by launching USA's official character-approved blog site, that celebrates everything that's making culture waves and positively impacting American society. Have a look by logging on to characterblog.com. Here's some quick feedback we want to relay to you about the tvnews.tv. You know, some of our loyal viewers have said, Jeff, I have a hard time carving out six plus minutes a day for the TV news. You know what? Try this. Because the TV news is all video, start the news Put it in the background, do what you have to do, and if something piques your interest, just bring it to the foreground and get more familiar with it. Now, when you read other trade pubs online, you have to devote 100% of your attention to it. Not so with the TV news. And that's the TV news advantage. And that about does it for this edition of the TV news. We will be back tomorrow with a fresh edition, and EMAC will be in, and that can only mean the Sports TV News. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. We thank you for watching, and as always, go out and make it a good day. The TV News has been brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. 
for all of your electronic marketing and creative challenges, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution.